Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bring you guys my face, and yes folks, it is time for, I guess we're gonna call it a face reveal, even though we already did this at 50k, but we're doing it again here today for 1 million subscribers, and I want to thank you guys uh, for helping me achieve this goal that, if you would have told me like three years ago that my channel would be here, I'd probably freak out. Actually, has it been going for three years? Almost three years, something like that. But yeah, thank you guys for all the support. It's absolutely amazing to accomplish this. So I figured, you know what, let's go ahead and do a face reveal because it was kind of coming up anyways because we're going to be doing a, uh, I guess we call it a con or it's called Retro Palooza and it starts next weekend. It's going to be October 19th and the 20th and me, Brandon, OB, and Spy are all going to meet each other. We've actually got a couple panels there. And that's going to be something. It's going to be strange. I have to deal with OB in real life. It's not going to be good. So about the face cam here. Uh, it's not going to be on all the videos. It might be on select videos. And I'm saying very few select videos. Uh, I don't really particularly enjoy them. Like when I record my videos, I record how I would watch it. And I don't watch a bunch of gaming YouTubers with face cams because honestly... It throws me off. I don't really like to watch somebody's reaction because it seems to always go from like a reaction that should have been like a one and they go to like a 10 because they're watching themselves in a camera or something. So you won't be really seeing that from me often, but I figured this is a good time to do it. Now, I do have something uh, that I think you guys are going to like. This thing, as soon as it gets into focus, oh, you can see my messy desktop. I just exploded a couple folders in there, but yeah. Uh, million play button very cool to see here uh, Yeah, and another thing you're probably noticing is the whole fact that I'm playing my very first video in the background I kind of wanted to play that because you can kind of like hear the difference in the way I talk and the audio quality and everything Here, let me play a, a short clip here. Uh, you're gonna have to listen to this seats I'm probably only gonna do one seat on each side. I thought about doubling them up, but that's probably gonna be a little too massive maybe Maybe somewhere down the line I'll build something this massive, but I want this to work, so let me let me see kind of where the driver's seat. Yeah, that's not pretty. If I could talk to myself in 2016 when I started, I'd be like, don't record in a room the size of a garage. Go get yourself some soundproofing. Do something. Uh, but yeah, uh, also I do apologize because the mic's here. This is just my normal mic position. Uh, that way I know it kind of works with my room. And, of course, I'm not recording in the big room anymore. I've actually got my own dedicated space. Uh, if you saw my house tour, I kind of, right when I first moved in, I showed you guys the house. It didn't really have furniture in it, but it, it does now. And this is my recording room slash uh, music room. You probably see all the stuff behind me here. So, uh, one thing I wanted to bring up, of course, the, the first video, just to kind of show you that. Another thing um, I wanted to bring up, of course, is the Retro Palooza thing. So if you do want to show up to it, I'll have a, a link in the description. Uh, I'm assuming we're going to meet people. I don't 100% know what's all going to happen. I think we're going to be on a couple panels, which is going to be really different for me. But yeah, that'll be a thing. Uh, any other updates? I guess we should use this to update about the channel. Uh, I grew a beard. Uh, I don't know if I exactly like it. I'll probably shave it off. Uh, if you look at, you know, my older videos, I was very clean shaven and I, I let that go away. So I have to see what I'm going to do there. Uh, let's see what else. The channel itself. I guess we should talk about it. If you guys have any suggestions for the channel, uh, let me know down in the comment section, whether it be games, uh, things you want to see, things you don't want to see. Uh, I'm going to try to answer as many things down there as possible. Uh, I think the channel is in a really, really good spot now. Uh, if you would have asked me about two years ago or a year and a half ago, I probably would have told you not so much, but we have finally, I feel like, expanded. Like when I first started, which I do think Scrap Mechanic, and that's another reason I'm showing it, that first video is actually where my channel really got momentum. I got lucky. Uh, Scrap Mechanic had just came out. I guess I clicked with the YouTube algorithm immediately, and I started to get views. And I owe a lot to that game, but I felt like after playing it for like a year, half a year, whatever it was, I started to get stuck. And I was like, I don't want to get stuck in like one game or two games. I want to be able to play a little bit more. So one thing I'm really happy about is the whole fact that we have variety on the channel. 
and for the most part, most things do relatively well. So I'm hoping to continue that. So hopefully we'll be able to continue to play new games. Uh, play our old games. Of course, I don't forget about all the series that are doing well. I mean, I forgot about a couple series, but most likely they weren't doing really well. Except for you have that one person that's still like, Komodo, where is this series? You haven't played it in like two years. I'm waiting for the next episode and most likely it's not going to happen. But I'm always open to new suggestions for games. But anyways, I thought I would show you guys the uh, the gold play button. I'm extremely proud of that. Uh, I kind of wish I had matching play buttons. I have the old, like my 100k one is the old one that's in the glass and it's actually the button. And these new ones are kind of more of like a plaque, which I do like the new ones, but I really wish I had two that match. And I really need to hang them up somewhere in this room. I'll have to figure that out. But like I said, I just want to thank you guys. I wanted to go ahead and do this. Um, you'll be seeing maybe some sort of vlog thing when we go uh, to uh, the Retro Palooza, which is in Arlington, Texas, if you wanted to know where it is. So if you're like really close to the DFW area, uh, you can look it up down in the description. And if you want to show up, you can do that. I'll be giving away stickers. I know I bought a ton of stickers. They're like these really big Komodo gaming stickers. So I'll probably have some of those. So if you want to grab one of those uh, I'll have hopefully enough I don't know maybe I'll have too many uh, we'll see how it's gonna go though but I think that's gonna about wrap it up it's my face this is what I keep getting questions on every day like Komodo show us your face and here it is my face my beard uh, my my room my guitars my noise foam stuff yeah but Thank you guys for watching, and we will see you guys next time.